vegetables are really like a staple to fall, winter. Yeah, these are little fingerlings. We're gonna make some pan roasted potatoes. And I've chosen two different kinds. These are the fingerlings, which are perfect for pan roasting because they're small. These are gorgeous red and purple potatoes. So I'm just gonna slice the fingerlings in half so that they cook a little bit faster. When I'm thinking about picking potatoes, I think about the texture and I think about the flavor. And something like fingerlings, which happen to be my favorite, are very sweet and creamy. It's best suited to pan roasting. It's creamy, but it's also dense. And then something like the purple and the red would be really gorgeous to make a potato salad or to do, you could definitely do a mashed potato with these. So I take some young garlic from the farmer's market. I'm just gonna cut it into little slivers. Put out of the oil to the pan and it's on a medium high flame. Add the garlic, some rosemary, some thyme. Just finely chop the herbs. We're gonna add them to the garlic. <laughs> I think people are afraid of potatoes now because in the United States, people think of potatoes as just pure carbohydrate. And potatoes are actually quite nutritional. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm just adding it to the garlic and herbs. Potatoes are rich in potassium, vitamin A, enzymes and minerals. They're easy to digest. It's really good to eat the skin of the potatoes. As with a lot of vegetables, that's where the highest concentration of nutrients is. So this is the red and purple potatoes. So these I'm just cutting into smaller pieces so we can cook them with the fingerlings just to add some color. The colored potatoes have a little bit of a denser quality than the fingerlings. And because I cut them small, they should cook up at the same rate. Let's see. I'm gonna... mm. Need a couple more minutes. So I'm adding some sea salt with rosemary. Potatoes can take a lot of salt. Peppercorn. The smoked paprika. Pan roasted potatoes give you kind of a similar texture to a french fry, but it's so much more. You get a deeper flavor from the roasting. You're not frying. You are using oil, but it's not a deep fry. It gives the crispy outside when you pan roast or oven roast with the creamy center that gives you the same satisfaction that would come through a french fry through the pan roasting. It's almost there. Um, you know, it's just almost the core that still needs to be cooked through a little bit. Fingerlings are dumb, and the colored potatoes are definitely denser. They're cooking a little bit more slowly. A lot of times people think of the potato as the french fry or mashed potatoes or just the brown oblong shaped potato, and there's so many subtleties to different potatoes. Potatoes are good with breakfast, with eggs and roasted tomatoes. I put potatoes in soup a lot. Sometimes I'll do potatoes in a part of a salad. They're just so versatile. They take on whatever flavor you want.